New Zealand's top male shot putter Tom Walsh is back in town after a successful campaign during the European summer. Gordon Finlater caught up with him. The international shot putter come part-time builder arrived home just over a month ago. This week is his first back in the gym and after some time off he's feeling the pinch. Yeah I got out of bed this morning I was like oh my hammies my legs oh a bit sore but uh, look it's been good to be, get back into building. The first day back on the building side I was chipping up concrete so that was fun but uh, apart from that mate it's good to be back in New Zealand I was away for a long time. The almost five month venture saw Walsh competing against the best in the world finishing fourth at the world champs in Beijing. He then created history in Brussels, becoming the first Kiwi male to win a Diamond League event, defeating current world champion Joe Kovacs in the process. Now back home on the building site, Walsh is just a tad modest about his world-beating accomplishments. It's not like I'm an All Black or anything like that, because I'm, I'm not, you know, it's All Blacks are up here in New Zealand. Um, and if I came back to the building site being an all black, I'd be, you know, a superstar of God and I'd be able to do anything. Um, where, look, they still, they, they understand, kind of, what I've done, but not to the full extent, if that makes sense. And I don't, I don't think anyone in New Zealand, well, certain people do, but a lot of people don't in terms of until you see it, until you kind of see how, how the competition is and, and what we have to go through. Now amongst the world shot putting elite, one could ask why Walsh has the need to work while he's back in the country. I had a comp in March, I still haven't been paid for that. <laughs> so it's a bit of a kind of, you know, you just got to wait and hang around. So probably in December I'd like to have most of my prize money, but uh, you know, so uh, there's a bit of waiting period, so that's what the work is there for. And also for just my mental space, mate, just to, you know, keep me as, uh, as normal as possible. Now balancing his building with a daily training schedule, Walsh will build up for competition in the New Zealand summer before another Northern Hemisphere summer in his build up to Rio. The travel is something the man from Timaru is becoming accustomed to. Yeah mate, missing out of the winters. A few cold days here at the, you know, when I got back, but uh, you know, it's, uh, it's a tough part of my life mate, summer to summer. <laughs> Gordon Findlater, CTV Sport.